Hey, how's it going? It's Khirwaya, thanks for tuning in. Today, we're going to be talking about this. I don't know if you can see the entire logo, but it's the Paul George logo for his Nike signature line, and it's the sixth edition, the Nike PG6. Check it out. So today we're going to be talking about already the sixth edition of Paul George signature shoe, the PGs. Uh, but before we get into that, whenever a shoe has, you know, a, a box that's a little bit different uh, than most, that has, you know, some some storytelling to it, we're going to start off with that. And as I already said, there's the PG logo right here and the Nike swoosh. Uh, then we have the uh, PG signature, and right here it says. Paul George 6, the PG6, and I don't know how how you can, if you can really see or tell, but these are basically clouds all over the shoe. And if you have been keeping up with our uh, blogs and video reviews, and actually I think one of the, the, maybe the first or the second review I did for uh, Gross Basket was actually for the PG2s. And the, the main story about, with his shoes was always clouds. Paul, Paul George wanted a feeling as if he was walking on clouds. And trust me, Nike and PG have been able to pull this off ever since the first edition of the shoe, and especially with this year's edition, but we'll get into that a little bit later. So here it is, here's the shoe. Uh, some people have said that it, it's plain looking, but I actually like that because it's so focused on basketball on performance and it's just I, th I think it still has you know the elegance and and details that make it stand out and actually with this colorway i think there's also the cloud theme and message uh that can be uh, talked about here you know with the combination of of the this this see-through ice uh blue and and the white so it's you know really everything's combined so well and and I like I like it how the Nike swoosh here pops out. It's woven and it's you know it's it, it has a premium feel to it. So really nice details right from the start. Uh, but then, as I said, we're going to be talking about the tech specs of the shoe. And the first thing that we have to point out, and the you know which surprised a lot of people, is the fact that there's no air technology in this shoe. Uh, it, is, it is a bit of a shocker, but what Nike and PG did with the Nike React Foam, all of those, uh, all of you who know uh, Nike shoes and Nike technology, you can see these details here are basically clear giveaways that it's React Foam. And I guess there are different kinds of Nike React fo uh, Foam, and this one is the one that's really similar to the original React Foam that started with the Nike running program, and it feels so great when you put the shoe on. You see the smile on my face? It's because I have another pair of PG6s on my feet right now. I mean, it's just, they are so great, and uh, you, will, you will love it when you put the shoe on, but you will not only feel the clouds under your feet, you will feel it above your feet as well because the tongue is so, soft and, and when you put the shoe on it's it's great because it gives you a lockdown feeling you know that security but it also brings a smile to your face because as it's so comfortable and like I said the cushioning the whole setup it works wonders speaking of stability and security I like what they did with the laces here these two uh, side panels go all the way down so you can you know uh, tighten your foot as much as you want and need so nice a nice detail and touch there but now we have to go to another amazing detail of the shoe and that's right here the sole I mean it grips like you wouldn't believe I've been testing the shoe out uh, on the court here in Zagreb there have been people before me testing it out you know so there's always dust on it and whatever but the control was amazing and uh, it's it's easy, you know, just kind of wipe them down with your uh, with your hand to get get any dust uh, away from the shoe. Uh, there's also 
the PG logo right here, and it's actually a more durable rubber, you know, a firmer, stiffer rubber, which kind of provides additional uh, lateral uh, lockdown for the foot, but also, you know, helps you with your lateral cuts and moves. And uh, another big thing that's always been a, a story with PG shoes, that it's made for two-way players because PG, if you ask me, Paul George is basically one of the best two-way players in the NBA when he's healthy because, you know, he can do whatever is necessary on the defensive end and also dominate on the offensive side of the court. So that's, that's also uh, an, an important uh, thing with the shoe. Nike also said that the PG entire line from the first model to the sixth represents or portrays the evolution of basketball and the way how players are becoming positionless, how they can adjust to any role they have to fulfill on the court. And this is actually what this shoe is, is doing and supporting. So this is definitely something that you will have to uh, try on to see what I'm talking about, how great it is. I mean, there's more great details uh, with the shoe he knows. Paul George's signature, there's uh, the PG logo, the number 13 back here. Great, great things going on with the shoe. But the most important one is that, you know, you hopefully you can uh, have a chance, make the time to visit our stores in Ljubljana, Budapest and Zagreb, and then try the shoe on and you will know what I'm talking about. If not, you know, uh, get it online and trust me, you will, you will not regret uh, getting this shoe and just how great it is. And once you do all that, uh, as always, remember to subscribe to our channel, uh, leave your opinion, uh, you know, in the comments. Uh, let us know if you have any additional questions. And um, I think that's pretty much it. Thanks for tuning in and until next time, bye.